celebrate Black History Month, and today we feature one athlete who is helping change the sport of snowboarding. National correspondent Clayton Sandell is in Aspen, Colorado, with how he is bringing diversity to the forefront. It was the kind of jaw-dropping performance the crowd had never seen. Zeb Powell out of Waynesville, North Carolina, and that coffin to backflip? That is crazy. The Zeb Powell stealing the show at the 2020 X Games in Aspen, Colorado. Jumping and flipping his way right into fans' hearts. And guess what he gets? He gets some knocks! And a first place win. What a moment for Zeb Powell making his X Games debut. But here's the thing the rookie clutching the gold medal didn't even like snowboarding the first time he tried it. My teacher was mean and she set me up backwards too, so like it, it, none of it was appealing to me. For a while he turned to skateboarding, but his raw talent on the snow could not be ignored. So he's always been flipping and turning and he's always been on a board or something that will let him fly through the air. His parents, who adopted him at five weeks old, started sending him from his North Carolina home to snowboarding camp in Colorado. In a sport that traditionally is as white as the snow, Powell stood out. How many people were there doing this that look like you? There might have been one other black person on the mountain. Did you ever feel unwelcome in this sport? Um, luckily, like, no, I don't really have anything bad to say about anyone. But it isn't just that Zeb Powell is one of the few black faces on the slopes. Sports commentator Salema Masakella has watched generations of snowboarders over three decades. He says the 22-year-old has game-changing skills he's never seen before. He's a jazz musician on a snowboard. He improvises. You know, it's like, oh, this is a type of snowboarding, and this is an ability and an interpretation of the thing that is crazy and so artistic and spontaneous, but highly athletic, and also in the body of a young black kid who grew up in North Carolina. Powell's first appearance at the X Games changed everything. He gained a ton of new followers and support on social media. Fans who maybe for the first time saw themselves. I heard a lot of them like say they don't, they didn't even know that black people snowboarded, which is crazy. Uh, I mean, just coming from me, like I never even thought about it like that. Powell is still getting used to all the attention oh and all the selfies. Oh my god! All right, so what's it like being recognized like that? That's always crazy. This is the man. This is I just kind of fully embrace it, you know? Try to talk to everyone. But one thing he's sure of, he's using this new visibility to help make snowboarding much more diverse. I think the culture is just, it's so fun to be around. I love it. And You want to share that with people? Yeah, I mean, I think, I think a lot of people will love it. Inviting as many as he can to a sport that historically hasn't been very inviting. Recreation and luxuriating in the outdoors was sort of one of the last safe spaces that were built mostly specifically for white people on the back end of segregation in this country. And so it's going to take a very long time for those things to change. A ten, a ten. Powell didn't place at this year's X Games, but his mom says what's important is that her son knows he has a gift. And you got to use it right and stay humble and give back. And so far, that's what he's done, which makes me extremely proud. Prouder than any medal he could ever win. It's exciting because he really does have an opportunity to be so much bigger than, than, than snowboarding and to be like a, an icon for the sport in opening up accessibility and possibility to what the slopes can look like. It's like, you know, growing up watching Jordan or, or Kobe or Serena, Tiger. And then to see it come along in a young black man in America is just, it's just wildly powerful. For now, Powell says he'll be spreading the word through the videos he makes with his friends, hot dogging down the slopes and dropping into concrete canyons. Making sure that even though he's one of the few black pro snowboarders, Zeb Powell is not going to be the last. Clayton Sandell, Newsy, Aspen.